David here is an independent artist and he's going to tell us a little bit about this uh, robotic Zen garden. That might not be what it's called. I'm sure you can fill us in. It works. It, it counts as a Zen garden. So this is a cable driven sand plotter. So this is the second one that I've built. The first one's in a science center. They needed a drawing machine that would run all day, every day, without any sort of user intervention. So it's basically just a full CNC controller. It runs just like a mill. Uh, the only thing custom is it has a fancy kinematics module that'll basically calculate the lengths of the string on the fly several thousand times a minute, and then voila. D does it have sensor feedback to know where it is right now? Nope, uh, full open loop just runs off steppers. Okay. And the uh, controller is basically just running off a of beagle bone black on this one. And okay, what was the first one running off of? First one was actually running off a full desktop computer, mini ITX. It's amazing, like just in the last year and a half, you went from something that took up like a bookshelf size kind of thing to mm -hmm. now it's like size of a bread box. Yeah, can you tell me about the motor drivers on that board? Yeah, this one I'm just using Glow Loose. They're kind of cheap and cheerful. I mostly use them because I had them sitting on my shelf from several years ago and thought, well, I'd need to break that out for another hack. So there we go. What about the printing head itself? It looks like you have a machined aluminum piece. Yeah, basically all the machining on this I just did myself. So there's a machined aluminum one for that. All the pulleys are custom machined as well. And then I also CNC'd all the motor brackets. Um, with a Calgary Proto Space, so we've got a really nice 1800 pound CNC mill that's my, friend, my best friend ever. And uh, I'm much better with the hardware design than the software. It's more <laughs> fun. You get to make aluminum chips and everything else. Yeah, a big build like this is great. Thank you so much for sharing it with us. If oh. someone wants to learn more, is there a website they can go to? Yep, uh, davidbino.com. That's uh, Bino, B-Y-N-O-E. Very good. Thank you so much. Oh, you're welcome.